Okay, so the next question is level order traversal of a rooted tree can be done by starting from the root and performing and then the options are pre-order traversal, in-order traversal, depth first search or breadth first search. Okay, so what we have to do is level order traversal and what is given is a rooted tree. Okay, it might not even be a binary tree. It's the only thing that you know for sure is that it is a rooted tree. So suppose this is your root out here and then these are other nodes okay this, this is an edge to some node okay and then you go down like this okay you might have anything so it's it's a tree and this is the root out here and what do you understand by a level order traversal so in a level order traversal so what you do you first go through this node so you first go through this and it's because this is level zero okay so this is level zero you go through this and then you go to level one so this is level one so you might have something like this okay two three four so you 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 enumerate the nodes from the next level okay and then you go to the next level level two and then you write the nodes like this suppose five six seven eight so that's level order traversal going in this order one two three four five six seven eight and which of these will give level order traversal that's the big question of this thing so, uh, if you look at all these, can just think that which sort of search or which sort of traversal is going to go level by level, okay? And if you think a little bit, you know that the answer is breadth first search. Why? Because in breadth first search, suppose you start at root. So, I start at root. So, what I will do, I'll, I'll write 1 for root, okay? And then what I do is in breadth first search I traverse or I go to the nodes that are adjacent to this thing so what are the nodes that are adjacent to this so second one this third one all of these these four these are adjacent okay so in a breadth first search I'll go to them after this so I'll go to two three and four okay and then once this is done then I go like I do the same thing for two okay and then I do the same thing for 3 and I do the same thing for 4 alright and so I come to 2 and if I do the same thing for 2 what are adjacent to 2 5 and 6 so I go here and write 5 and 6 and I do the same for 3 then so there is 7 and I do the same for 4 and which is 8 so that's what you do in breadth first search and that's why it is the same as level order traversal because you are going level by level.